Hi guys, it's Paul from Paul Cold Cricket and I'm very excited to be showing you the 2022 update of the Phantom Dark Edition bat, uh, of course in the very top limited edition grade. Um, featuring a new look uh, for this year, as you can see, quite a dramatic change. Uh, they've got rid of the black and replaced it with this sky blue and, and chrome uh, design. Love the detailing, the embossing, uh, as we've always come to expect with Phantom stickers. Uh, yeah, new look, um, same quality attention to detail, if not, if not better than previous years. Uh, here with the matte black on the back. And I love this sort of glitter effect they've got in the Phantom Mask on the branding. It's present across the other bats too. I've mentioned that, how the back looks different to uh, the front. Yeah, pretty big departure really there, in terms of the uh, blue at least. Uh, I think Phantom are just trying to be a bit different because so many other brands have got like black edition bats now. It seems like pretty, almost everyone's got some, something in, the, in, in black. Obviously this dark, you might expect it to be black. It always was before, but now just mixing things up a bit. Nothing wrong with that in my opinion. It's not my favourite look in terms of the stickers within the Phantom range, but I still think, uh, generally speaking, the market as a whole, I think it's stunning. Um, yeah, really, really like it. In terms of the shape, that hasn't changed. They're always big full bats, these ones. 40 millimeter edges, 60, uh, 62 millimeter spine, and a 20 uh, millimeter toe. And as I said, very full convex profile. If you think off center, there's a lot of wood behind that. So no concaving whatsoever, very wide middle, very forgiving, uh, and a slight duck bill or duckling bill, as I usually tend to call it, um, there on the toe. Uh, this bat's quite heavy as far as dark editions go. They're usually around the 210, 211 mark. This particular one's actually 212. Um, and, but in terms of the pickup, I'd say it feels slightly lighter than that. For me, that's more of a 2, 210 and a half, 211 feel. So yeah, deep, very nice, light, balanced pickup there. Uh, it's a mid to low middle, you know, so impressive to be picking up so, so light. Uh, great for front foot play and, and slow pitches, of course. But as we'll soon see, in the mallet and the ball test, it's a very long uh, middle. Um, I'm surprised I haven't mentioned the grain structure. Uh, absolutely stunning uh, bat here, as you can see. Uh, pretty much all sapwood, and there's 15 grains there. Yeah, just look, as you would expect in this grade, but yeah, can't hurt to sort of, Phantom and, um, have their own willow supply now. So as I said in one of the other videos, they seem to be, um, a little bit nicer looking than in previous years, more consistently at least, in, in my opinion, that's just my observation. And certainly in these top grades, you know, you're just flawless willow that you just won't necessarily see with others, even in uh, their top grades. So it's something to maybe uh, bear in mind. Um, in terms of the bow, not too much there, but a little bit of curving down low, as you can see there. Um, and, and the handle I didn't mention, uh, I mentioned the pickup, but yeah, the handle is reasonably thick, maybe medium to thick, I'd say. Um, and semi over at the bottom, um, it's got the same um, ribbed grip and this blue colour to further accentuate that sort of blue theme there. Uh, but yeah, fairly thick and good for bottom handed or, or top handed players with, with that semi oval handle. In terms of that mallet test, then without further ado, let's uh, do the mallet from the toe up to the base of the stickers before bouncing the ball in it. Yeah, I mean, it's, I'd say medium to soft, um, gonna reach peak performance level early in its life for sure, as with pretty much all the other Phantom Bats I've been showing you lately. Um, off the ball, maybe even better. <laughs> um, yeah, amazing. Up high. Down low. Still needs knocking in, which of course is a service that Phantom can provide if you did need that. Um, little C marks of the ball to prove that it does need that knocking in. And crazy to think, scary actually to think that they're only going to get better after knocking in. Amazing how good these bats will eventually end up being. and They will reach peak performance level very quickly, as I said, I'm pretty much uh, convinced of that. But yeah, in terms of... Uh, the grading and the price and the, and the freebies. Uh, as I said, if you've seen the video I've done recently of the Profile 7 uh, in the Player Series, that was also in the limited edition grade, that Adoni um, interpretation of, it, of about, um, I mentioned about what was included for free and I'll, I'll share it again here in the Dark Edition because Phantom are very generous with their freebies uh, in this grade. Um, and amazingly, 
they include a free middling bat, uh, which in the case of the dark edition has the black stickers. You might have seen the other bat had the white stickers. You always get uh, the black one uh, appropriately uh, for the dark edition. And you know, these middling bats are normal weight, 2.9, 2.10 weights, they're massive, so you know, more realistic uh, than your average uh, middling bat. I remember I used one that was like £2.1 or something, it's just crazy. They're also English willow, so you know, butterfly willow, as you may notice there, and just massive, as I said. So if you want like realistic practice in the nets, um, to be getting this sort of quality middling bat and for free, just, I've not seen anyone else do that, so a big, big thumbs up for that, but it's not the only freebie you get, because you also get this incredibly good quality <laughs> bat coffin, about the most padding you could ever hope to have on a, on a bat cover, um, like a box design. You've got a little separate section even up here for a ball. Uh, these phantom tags on the zips to un undo them really easily. And you even get an additional bat sleeve, bat jacket if you like, which is this white one to further protect your investment, give that a bit of extra protection. Uh, so yeah, phantom certainly looking after you when it comes to the free extras. And it's good that they do that because the price is 600 pounds. So obviously, you know, not for everyone, price is a lot of you out of the market. I'm not gonna say it's extremely good value for money. I'm not, I'm gonna, not gonna lie. But unlike others, Phantom at least acknowledged that and including, you know, well over a hundred pounds worth of, of freebies, uh, you know, um, with the bout to, to look after you. and, and make that value much more competitive than a lot of other super top end bats that you're seeing from others. So you definitely have to bear that in mind, I think. In terms of uh, uh, the availability, uh, do check out the link in this description uh, to, uh, to order this bat from Phantom and they'll ship globally. So wherever you are in the world, you can get your hands on one of these beautiful bats. Uh, thanks very much for watching this video. Please do subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done so. I really, really do appreciate your support. That was the Dark Edition, Limited Edition Bat, uh, the new look for 2022. Thanks again, and I'll see you soon.